Now, Channel 3 Early Warning Weather with Chief Meteorologist Bruce DePriest. Well, it has turned out to be a misty afternoon in many parts of the state, but there's no heavy rain falling in Connecticut right now. So that's good timing for the afternoon drive home. Still uh, the uh, mist and some rain is reducing the visibility. We'll focus in on Danbury on early warning pinpoint Doppler. And right there around Danbury up toward Brookfield and Roxbury Falls, the rain is coming down steady and just a little bit harder. And the same is true as we get into uh, the uh, panhandle of uh, Fairfield County right there between uh, Ridgeway and North uh, Stamford, we are seeing a, a little pocket of some uh, moderate rain. Elsewhere, it's either doing nothing or the mist is coming down. All right, there's our iCam in Waterbury. You can see that the lights are on as we have the uh, dark overcast conditions on the highway right now. Uh, the uh, car lights and truck lights are on. And to go into Old Saybrook and notice the trees are kind of swaying back and forth. It's especially breezy near the coast and the boats are bobbing up and down as well. So the shoreline is getting buffeted by some uh, pretty good wind. We got a wind at 18 miles an hour in New Haven right now and a wind out of the east at 20 miles an hour in Bridgeport and even Waterbury at the Waterbury Oxford Airport. The wind is coming out of the east at 12 miles an hour, but the winds will be strongest along the shoreline as we go into this evening. New Haven is the warm spot in the state, 61 degrees there. Elsewhere, temperatures are in the 50s, pretty much where they've been all day long, and the mist and the fog is reducing the visibility. It's down to three quarters of a mile in Chester, three miles in uh, Groton, and at Bradley International Airport, the visibility has been reduced to two miles in drizzle and fog. So nothing really heavy in Connecticut now. The main event is still off to our west. That's a front. A low pressure system will develop on the front, and that means rain. So areas of rain and drizzle at 7 o'clock this evening. That will become steadier and heavier as we go into uh, later this evening and overnight. Then by 7 o'clock in the morning, there's still some lingering rain in eastern Connecticut. But weather conditions will quickly improve. The sky will become mostly sunny. A northwesterly breeze will pick up, gusting to over 20 miles an hour. And it's going to turn out to be a beautiful day. Thursday uh, looks like it's going to be a nice day as well with mostly sunny skies in the morning and fair skies as we go into the uh, late afternoon hours. Rainfall totals anywhere from three tenths to eight tenths of an inch of rain. So a decent soaking, but nothing that will cause any major problems other than some uh, puddles on the roadways and some wet leaves. Lows tonight, upper 40s and low 50s, and your highs for tomorrow in the mid to upper 60s, which is nice because the normal high for tomorrow is 61. Here's your seven day forecast. Thursday, mostly sunny, a high of 65 and a good amount of sunshine on Friday, 63. But there will be some showers moving through Friday night and Saturday morning. Those showers end early Saturday, then mostly sunny in 62. And here's the change to the weekend forecast. Yesterday, we thought Sunday would be OK. Now it looks like we'll be dealing with rain that could be an all day rain and a high of 52. The weather gets back on track uh, on a Monday with sunshine and 62 and for the shoreline tomorrow, a pleasant day with a high of 68.